Today we're going to through the bench press techniques. Things you need to know. First, set up the bench. Make sure it's in the middle and in a good position. Next, make sure that you set up the bar horizontally in the middle. If you need to, you can adjust it. You can do this also by laying down on the bench. And after that, set up the safety bars. If you have chance, then use the bench where you have safety bars and adjust them the correct height. If they are this type, adjust the both sides and make sure they are locked so that they cannot fall. You can test this by bringing the bar up. It should not fall in on your neck, but at the same time, it should fall on your chest and there should be a little cab. This way you can get out of there safely, even if it falls and you have no strength. If it's this kind of type, then make sure the ground support is also so that the, the supports cannot fall when you lift. Then set up the bar vertically correctly also. Make sure you don't have any weights when you do this. And set up in both sides and lock them properly so that it cannot fall while you lift. After that, you can test if the height is correct so that you can slide it normally. You can test it by just lifting. Take a normal lifting position. Make a test for this so that when you take the bar, do the normal repetition. And when you lift up, there should be a clear cap. It should not be barely there. There should be a clear cap. The lifting position should be straight below the eyes. Then the leg drive. Put your feet pointing a little bit outwards and bring them back so that you almost feel your heels getting up so that you push yourself towards the head, not up. After that, shoulder stacking. Put your shoulders down and back in a safe position. You can adjust them shoulders like I do. The lifting angle. When you lift up, you lift in an angle. You don't lift straight up. You lift in an angle. So the push comes from the legs and you just straighten the bar. After that, you're ready to make your warm up set. For your warm-up shape, do exactly the same position, shoulders, legs, everything, and take only 50% weight when you do this. This way your body gets used to the heavier weights before you do your maximum reps. With maximum reps, I mean the normal sets, like five times fives or something like that. This warm-up shape should not count to the actual five times five counts. Or if you do some other reps, other sets, this warm-up should be only extra. After that, you can move on your actual work set, which should be most of the time something like 85% of the maximum one rep that you can do. Of course, you can change that and you should change it in the long run when you start trying different stuff like going heavier, doing lower reps, make your body get used to the heavy weights. But in the beginning, it is better to stick with the 5 times 5 for quite a while and just do it with around 85% of your max rep. And remember all the details when you do this. And if you feel like you just don't have power to do this, then stop before anything happens. This rep I did with, uh, without the safety bars but I used safe weight, it wasn't that heavy. And then mark what you did, how many reps, how many sets, and set the target for your next repetitions as well, so that you know, know what you did last time and uh, what you're going to do next time. And remember to take water, of course. That's the bench press technique. And next we're doing more push techniques. and see you in the workouts.